Oh, hi. In the Epistemic Games Group, we build brain games. Games where players solve real problems the way real people do. In the game Land Science, players become urban and regional planners. They work together to solve economic, social, and environmental problems in their city. Land Science is a computer game which lets students play the role of interns at Regional Design Associates, an urban and regional planning firm in their state. The work begins when players get an email from Maggie, the lead planner at the firm and a fictional character in the game, who sends them a request for proposals from the mayor of the city. To get started on our proposals, we conduct a virtual site visit where we learn about the history of the neighborhood and the issues that one group of stakeholders in the city care about. Right now I'm just checking um, how um, open spaces, parking garages, parking spaces are affecting the city. Players use iPlan, a mapping tool that lets them change the zoning of the different parcels on a site. As they make changes, graphs show the projected impact on issues that stakeholders care about. Players team up to determine what the stakeholders will find acceptable. Then they regroup to develop a plan for the site. In the preference survey, we just had to please one stakeholder group. For our final plan and proposal, we need to create a plan that pleases all the stakeholder groups. After creating their plan, players write a formal proposal that justifies their choices. I'm changing State Street so that um, more people can shop there. It'll attract more people to shop, so more money. Along the way, players can communicate with live mentors using a built-in chat tool. Mentors model how professional planners work, help the players when they get stuck, and push players to reflect on their work. Land science can be played with middle and high school students in both formal and informal education settings. It can be played as both an individual activity as well as integrated into a larger study incorporating field work and scientific data collection. I just didn't realize how much they would personally take on these characters and I think we underestimate their problem solving and critical thinking skills. It's fun. I just kind of like to think about like what you could do, like like how to solve the problem. That's what I like to do.